Some days, the thought doesn't even cross my mind. I know it's there. Just like the physical and emotional scars I've acquired or self-inflicted. Even my five tattoos. They've all been a source of pain at one point or another, and now it's just a part of me. Other days, I can't get it out of my head. I walk through those from the moment I wake till I curl up with my dogs in bed, feeling like damaged goods. Beating myself up because I didn't act as I should. If given the chance to be 21 again, use a condom this time, I'd like to think that I would. Time and again, I've heard how there's nothing more important than family. That experience is Japanese to me. I'm asked sometimes if my family even knows. The question is almost always followed by expressions of confusion and disbelief when it is learned that the answer is no. As if because they are family, they're entitled to this information about me. How could I possibly keep this from them? But they'll never hear it from my lips. Even though I'm sure they've imagined it. They come from the school of thought that AIDS is what happens to junkies and fags, that this is God's wrath. Being both addicted and gay were two strikes against me. The fact that I subscribed to the same belief as them made three. So for me, testing positive for HIV was merely a self-fulfilled prophecy. <laughs>